Hello, Marc-Antoine. Nice to see you. Hi, Eric. So, Marc-Antoine, 2021 is over. How did it go for Centréon? 2021 uh, went very well for Centréon. Uh, we had a growth of uh, 56%, which is uh, fantastic. It's basically 15 million euro revenue, uh, nearly 17 million in USD. So it's, it's a very good result. And I'm very proud to say that we had 169 uh, new customers, which is a very good result. Yeah. Impressive, Marc-Antoine, indeed. Um, so uh, beyond the numbers, what were the achievements uh, you did in 2021? First, uh, beyond the very nice figures we had, uh, I would like to point out the four major initiatives that we had uh, last year. Uh, the first one was the launch of our SaaS platform. We worked uh, very hard on that to propose this new offering to the, to the, to the market at the beginning of uh, 2022. The second was uh, the new dynamic for our community. Uh, we launched the new platform, The Watch, where you know all our community, uh, open source community and customers can meet and exchange good practices and see uh, uh, how to improve their monitoring you know, strategy. We were also very pleased to, um, to do the first Centrion Summit last year. Uh, more than 600 persons you know, went to this, uh, to this summit and um, they had the opportunity to talk with the, the experts and with the entire Centrion team. So it's a big success. And the last one is the Centrion team who grew by you know, almost by 40%. We reach 120 people uh, working here, so it's uh, it's very nice to have all these new joiners. Yeah, impressive, Marc Antoine. What a busy year! Uh, in addition to that, is there any accomplishment or number you would like to call out? I would like to point out our international expansion. Uh, last year, 70% um, of our global revenue were coming from outside uh, France. And, and we would like to uh, increase this, uh, this share in the next years, and particularly in 2022. Uh, we launched a new uh, partner uh, program, and we managed to hire many last year, uh, nearly 30 new partners in France, but also abroad, uh, in North America, in LATAM, uh, all across Europe, and even to Asia. And uh, we will continue this, uh, this uh, strategy in 2022 by hiring new partners, uh, to increase our revenue everywhere. Great, congratulations for a fantastic 2021. Now talking about this year, 2022, what are the perspectives you can share with us? The new uh, uh, SaaS offering uh, that will be available in March 2022 uh, will help us to continue this, uh, this growth, as you can imagine. Uh, our plan is also to hire more partners and we will work with them more closely because the cloud offer will require us a more, more proximity with them to deliver this value that we want to, to offer to final customers. We want to hire these partners everywhere, as you can imagine, France, our main market, our historical market, but also Europe, North America, LATAM, and even in Asia. Our, pers our, 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 our target on this part is to recruit 50 more new partners. Uh, when you think that we have 30 last year, it's a, it's a big step for us. And the last but not the least, it's also the investment that we want to do on the on the R&D department. It's an important uh, part of our strategy because we want also to increase the value for the customers. Fantastic. Can't wait to see this happen. Thank you, Marc-Antoine. Talk soon. Welcome. Bye.